Hi friends, this is Janaki. I am happy to be on thankyouchup.com. In this video, I am going to make chilli garlic brinjal curry. Now let's see the ingredients. 7 brinjal, 1 and a half piece onion, 1 fourth tablespoon turmeric powder, 1 tablespoon red chilli powder, 4 tablespoon cooking oil, that is for frying brinjals, 12 tablespoon oil for frying onion paste, half cup tamarind juice, masala items. 1 and a half tablespoon red chilli powder, 4 to 5 garlic, 2 tablespoon of salt. Seasoning items 3 red chillies, 1 garlic, half tablespoon of mustard, half tablespoon zira, and 5 curry leaves. Now let's see each item in the video. Brinjals, 1 and a half piece onion, turmeric powder. Cooking oil, small piece of tamarind, soak tamarind and make a juice out of it. That should be thick juice. Masala items, red chilli powder, garlic, salt. Seasoning items, red chillies. Mustard, Zira, and curry leaves. Now let's start the process. Cut the onions into small pieces and make onion paste that should be thick paste. Now grind red chilli powder, garlic, and salt. Make a powder out of it without adding water. Now take salt water, cut the brinjals like flower shape and soak them in salt water. If you do this way, brinjals won't become bitter and color will not change. Now fill the garlic chilli masala in open edges of the brinjal. Repeat the same process for all the brinjals and keep it ready. Heat the oil, then fry red chillies, garlic, mustard. And zira. Fry them until it splutters. Finally, add curry leaves. Then add onion paste. Mix well and cook for two minutes with lid. After 2 minutes, just mix the onion paste and add 1 tablespoon of salt. Mix well and cook with lid for another 2 minutes. Now add turmeric powder. Mix well and fry until the water leaves from the onion paste. Then add half cup of thick tamarind juice. Mix well. And add half tablespoon of red chilli powder. Mix well and cook for a minute. 
Now add one cup of water. Mix the gravy and cook without the lid. Meanwhile, heat the oil and fry the brinjals on a medium flame. Cook with lid for three minutes. In between, tilt the brinjals to the other side also, and cook for another three minutes. Make sure that brinjals are cooked well. Then add those brinjals to gravy. Mix well. Now add another half tablespoon of red chilli powder and salt. Mix well and let it cook for some time until the oil comes out from the masala. Finally add curry leaves. Crush the curry leaves and add so that it gives yummy flavor. Mix gently. And finally transfer it into a serving bowl. That's all. Very tasty, tasty chilli garlic brinjal curry is ready. Finally garnish with coriander leaves and have it. This curry goes well with uh, hot rice and even with rotis also. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to watch for more videos, visit thankyouchef.com. Bye.